Dead gummit. People think that we're the bad guys, but hunting is ecological management. Without us, deer populations explode. Look, I was just running. The woods used to go on forever. Now it's just cul-de-sacs and Subaru Outbacks. I can't tell what's woods or driveway anymore. The deer came out of nowhere. Now my bumper's gone and my insurance says it's not even covered. I wasn't even going that fast, like 45. Okay, 50. Vermont's white-tailed deer population has been steadily rising since natural predators like the catamount were wiped out. In 2021, Vermont Fish and Wildlife reported that there were 133,000 deer in the state. Overpopulation means more crop loss, forest segregation, and car accidents. Exactly, but there's ways to work with the deer rather than against them. We need to be implementing smart coexistence strategies, things like wildlife crossing, better habitat management, and public education. Because it's not just a deer problem, it's a human wildlife problem. Dealing with deer overpopulation isn't a straightforward issue. It has many stakeholders and requires finding the right balance. At the end of the day, we're sharing this landscape and both deer and humans need spaces to live safely.